Dark days ahead for Americans as the number of corona cases across the country doubling every five days, according to the Johns Hopkins University. New York still the state hardest hit. This is going to be the hardest and the saddest week of most Americans' lives, quite frankly. This is going to be our Pearl Harbor moment, our 9-11 moment. President Trump, though, insisting there is still hope. We're starting to see light at the end of the tunnel. And hopefully in the not-too-distant future, we'll be uh, very proud of the job we all did. And again, the president floating the idea Americans could somehow attend Easter Sunday services with distancing, his own medical experts adding context to those comments. What you're hearing about potential light at the end of the tunnel doesn't take away from the fact that tomorrow the next day is going to look really bad. So we've got to make sure we realize we're always talking about a two and a half week lag. Dr. Fauci also saying it's important to get the virus under control globally or it could become a seasonal problem, reminding we need a vaccine to prepare if it comes back around again. We are struggling to get it under control. A lot of money and effort being put into that vaccine. Uh, Bill Gates announcing that his foundation is putting billions into it, helping to build seven factories to run simultaneous tests of vaccine, rushing to find that. Working from home, I'm Kirsten Cole, Pix 11 News. Back to you, Kat.